Hello everyone, Mike Money Gamer here. How's it going? Um, I'm back here at the Wise Out Forest and, Dar and the game Dark Cloud, and um, we're about to go into Territory 14. Um, what I did off screen, just to tell you real quick, is I bought some more. Um, uh, what's it called? Repair powder, and I bought an Attack Plus One attachment. I'll uh, tell you what I'm gonna do. Uh, what I'm gonna do with that later. But. Um, as you see, I'm using a different weapon. I'm using the sax. I didn't actually, um, you know, find any off-screen like I said I wasn't going to, so I'm only using this just for fun, you know, to uh, see how this goes. It seems to do enough damage to merit using it. Besides, if you ask me, I could see a... Uh, Sacks being a good thing against some of the enemies here anyway because of the fact that many of the enemies are plants and this would probably be used to cut down trees and stuff, so yeah, I don't know. That's just my uh, uh, two cents on that. <laughs> so they have all the items for us today. Nice. Let's grab this uh, little piece of atla here that we could use. Looks like a giant walnut. We got a couscous. I don't know what that is. Actually, it's like... Is it like a type of rice meal or something like that? Anyway. Uh, that's not really what it is, but... I just thought I'd try cracking a joke. And we got some bread there, which is nice, because I did have to get some more of that. Ah, here's a new weapon, uh, new enemy. Uh, werewolf. They're pretty tough. I don't think you can block any of their moves. Ouch. Ah, fuck. That wasn't good. Yeah, here's one of my stand-in powders. Yeah, we'll use him. Run away like a little puss because we need him to come over here so we can get away from that pumpkin bomb jackass. There we go. I was gonna buy a. Uh, ooh, wow! A fire elemental thing while I was out, but um, I decided not to because, um, like you know, for your weapon, not one of these things, and uh, put it on John's weapon. But um, instead, I decided to just uh, you know stick with what it has. I think the attribute that's on it right now, like I said, is Wind and Holy. Holy might work against this, so let's try Holy. He's a werewolf after all. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. How do we kill the pumpkin bong jackass? Oh, we can't pick up any Atla because uh, what's his name is dead. That's just great. I'm gonna be trying to leave this place as soon as possible because of this whole thing going the way it's going because I don't want to have to, you know, not get the atla. Wow. It takes 40 something damage, that's just insane. So I already got two of the items, so let's see if we can't find the exit. I mean, I'm sorry, but there's just nothing I can do if that's the case. Some sundew I can sell? That's kind of nice. Oh, Halloween, let's run past him. I guess we can take on this werewolf guy. He shouldn't be too much of a trouble. As you can see, he will block attacks though, so you gotta be careful with that. There we go. Okay, there's another one of the items, so we got all three of them now, I believe. So there's nothing here, right, except for another Halloween. Let's get out of here. Oh, hey, Keaters. Hey, don't step on that, please. Thank you. 
don't know why she's up here. Uh, my, my mom, who she loves to hang around, is downstairs. I guess she's just curious on what I'm doing because of the storm that we had. She usually gets very lovable after a storm because she likes to know that we're still all home instead of just leaving here alone. We have accidentally done that before. Just more or less abandoned her here and she didn't she wasn't too happy with us after that. <laughs> Let's just put it this way, when we got home, she was like all over us, like, you're never leaving again type thing, you know. <laughs> I'm sure you guys have pets like that. Especially if you have, um, I know some people have, uh, like dogs who would probably do that. Through this door. There you go. I, mean, I guess I could go after all of the, uh, you know, um, what are they called? Uh, treasure chest, but, um, I really don't care. Yeah, that went rather well, I guess despite the fact that we got owned in the face. So let's leave the dungeon because we need to heal him up and that's the only way to really do it. <clears throat> now in this game there's no like, you know, go somewhere and rest option, you know, you can't do that. Um, it's just you're either, um, hurting for more, um, you know, healing odds or whatever. I guess, I, I guess you get healed automatically whenever you leave a dungeon, though, all the same, but I mean, because I wasn't healed before, so, yeah. Listen up, Mr. Al, I need some, uh, bread from, from you. Plenty of space. Sell one of these. I am planning, if you're wondering why I still have these, I am planning on using them eventually. I just haven't found a good opportunity because you don't want to waste those because if you waste them on an item that's almost full, you know, that's just stupid. Like I thought about using it on the, um, what's it called? Um, one weapon that I have, the, um, sax and or the, um, trying to think, um, serpent sword, yeah, or whatever, you know, the one we got to kill, the one snake that turned into a regular weapon afterwards, um, yeah, that one, can't think of anything else that we might want. So I think we're good for now. I already finished all the things he wanted because he gave me a item for it, apparently. So that means I had to have done everything right. Okay, so adventure day ducks time. I don't know what that proves or anything. I didn't find any items. I kind of ran around here just a little bit. Besides that one item I showed you, I didn't find anything else. I don't think they can disappear for good if you miss them by mistake. I think they'll just appear again later on if you make that mistake, so... Okay, there's some bread for us. A mage slayer, yeah, we do need that. Can we climb this? Yes, we can. <coughs> I don't know if there's anything up here, though. Yeah, just a lookout point, okay. He doesn't slide down it like an awesome person. He actually climbs down, so... Yeah. We need your house. We need a second floor restore thing there. We need to find room for it. Oh yeah, might as well see if I have anything for them. 
Let's see, um... Yeah, Cal's Cal's his house. Mysterious character who likes candy, let's put him in his house. He'll want that, it goes right there, the grass. Uh, let's put that there for them. Anything else that we might have almost finished? Nope, okay, so let's go back to Cal's Cal's house, put a sign on him. And a torch. Maybe I'll like pull out my uh, pull up my other file and see what it is that um, they want. Let's take a look. When you come here, you see this fat guy, and you're like, "Whoa, hi, who are you?" Oh, I see. I'm Kaus Kaus. Nice to meet you, Michael. I can't go out of this house, so come visit me once in a while. Hello. Oh, why is it that I stay in here? I just can't get out, that's why. I used to be able to, but after a while I found that I couldn't anymore, because I kept eating lots of sweets. I wonder if there's any way to make your body shrink. <laughs> yes, it's called working out. How should I re rebuild the town? Me, I just like high places, that's all. So we'll have to take care of that when we get a chance, but what will happen when it's done? So you can hide your valuables inside this fluffy grass, I'll always keep an eye on them for you. And what do you need for your house? It'd be cool if grass was growing all at the top of the shell. Okay. Oh, there's a little treasure chest down here. There's a gourd. Anything else in here? Nope. Okay. Okay, so, um... Go back into the genome area. Do a config and assembly. I have the earth piece out somewhere, do I? Oh, no, I don't. That's what you need it for, is to put it underneath his house. Oh, that thing's big. Okay, um... need a spot for it. You want to move his house on top of it after you find a... Good spot, but you don't want him too far away from the town, either. Hmm. I got an idea. Move and remove. See, I can't move him over here, can I? No. Let's move him right here for now. See if we can't put down that earth now. What about Earth B? Hmm. Oh, well, we need to go by the uh, mushroom house anyway. Come on. Hey, you, this way, come on. Come on up here. There, you can climb that ladder. Alright. What's up? What do you think? The view from here is great, isn't it? Well, sort of. I'm so happy now that the house is restored. I owe all this to you. Really, thank you so much. <laughs> now, I need to return the favor. Let's see. Hmm. Right, that's it. I have just the thing. Honey, what's keeping you? Where did I put it? Ah. Ah. Uh, found it. <laughs> oh. Ah. Ah. Uh. Oof. Oh my god. Ouch. Well, he can still move, so I guess he's alright. Here it is. 
moon grass seed acquired. I found it walking in the woods like a few giant mushrooms. It never grows wherever I plant it. Trent said it would be something very good someday, but it only grows in a special place in the woods. Since you seem to go in, seem to go into the woods a lot, you might be able to find that special place. Oh yeah, this is required for something else. Good luck to you. Bye. Actually, if you saw, there was a treasure chest on his top floor. But before we go up there, um, let's go search the town for some more treasure, since that's what that other view thing is supposed to show you, is that there's treasures all over the town for you to pick up. Like this floating one here. What the hell? Uh... <laughs> Nice. There we go. We got it. We brought it back. Okay. Just a little bit of, um, not loading there, you know. Nothing serious. Grab that prickly that we can sell. This fruit of Eden that we can eat. Let's see, um, who needs that the most? What is it? That's the thing that, yeah, puts up your health. Looks like Nikita needs it. Gourd will put up our thirst. Either John or uh, oh, Nikita needs it, so let's not give it to uh, jo uh, Nikita. Stupid freaking thing. There we go. Ta da! Alright, there's the moon grass seed, by the way. You can't do anything with it, like I said, right now. That's it, really. Um, so let's go back uh, around looking for more treasures. Mm. Here's one over here. A fire gem, that's uh, something I was looking for, which is kind of nice. That I nearly bought, by the way, which is kind of funny. We're walking around the village at night. <laughs> Anyway... No, nothing over there. Let's try the house. Yep, here's some fire. And a beast buster. That's nice. Anything else? No, that's it, looks like. So that's good. items inside the item shop, so I don't really look there. I wish I could figure out where to put his uh, earth item that he needs. Anything inside the mill? Let's see. There's a gourd, which is nice. Go over here. Nope. Okay. Yeah, like I've said before, I don't know if I've uh, said this enough. Um, always go back to houses after you leave a dungeon and just look around them and uh, inside as well because you never know when you're going to find more treasure chests ready waiting for you to pick them up. The game is pretty uh, generous with them, if you ask me at least, because I've never had too many you know, times where uh, I don't find any. Or like a shell in white in color. Oh, and it was really sweet. I think he. I think it's kind of like a peppermint. So we don't have one yet. I don't remember where we get it either. Like I've said before. Uh, there's the uh, lute playing guy who sang for us, which was kind of cool. Let's go raid his house to see if he has anything for us. There's something. A throbbing chair that we can sell. Okay, here's a piece of cheese. I don't know what that 
put it on his uh, table there. Ah, there's a plant buster. Awesome. Let's put these items to use that we're finding. Let's see. Um, okay, I already got a plant buster on here, and a beast buster, and a stone breaker for some stupid reason. What does this need to build up? Attack, speed, and uh, magic. It needs ice, wind, and holy on it. And uh, what else is that? Um, Looks like Beast, Metal, and um, Mage, I believe. So, things that I don't even have on it. That's almost leveled up, so I don't need to put anything on it yet. Uh, what about you? What do you need to build up? Attack, Speed, Magic, Ice, and Thunder Elemental, Metal, and uh, Mage Slayer. Okay, what's about the other one? Uh, just magic and attack, ice, um, what is that, um, it's not skull killer, even though it does make, kind of would make sense, I think it's undead buster or something like that, mage buster and, uh, metal buster, I guess is what they're all called, is buster, so let's see, what does it have on it right now, it has nothing on it, okay, so let's put, uh, some attack on it, a mage slayer, and, uh, what was the other thing? Uh, it wanted ice, which I don't have. Okay. Well, I did want some magic, too, so let's put that on it. And, uh, let's use up one, let's, uh, use one of our power-up powders. Level upgrade to Serpent Sword 1. Attack went up by 1, Endurance went up by whatever, Speed went up, and so did magic. So, okay, let's see what else we can throw on there. Okay, right, wait, let's go to build up. Okay, I still need more attack. Still need ice. I still need more uh, Mage Slayer, okay. So I don't have anything else I can put on that, but that was for fun anyway. Um, there's junk on this Gladius for some reason. Was I planning on doing something with that? Because I have two of them, don't I? No, I don't. Okay, good. I have two cry uh, Crystal Knives, though, so good. Nothing on this one. Plant Buster, Speed, and Beast Buster. Attack, Ice, and Holy. Um, looks like it wants more Beast Buster. Um, metal or Stone. I don't know what that is. I think it's probably Metal and Mage Slayer. So I'll have another Mage Slayer. And the dagger can't be upgraded, which is kind of a disappointment. <laughs> I wish you could make your dagger better, like, have like a, uh, have three different daggers, have like the first one, then the second one, and the third, and then each be project progressively more powerful. I guess I can look at my other teammates. Let's see, what does Steve need to be to be built up to like Super Steve or something like that? I can't remember. Okay, attack, endurance, speed, and magic. Uh, thunder and holy. And just those three basic things there, too. Okay, so I can't do anything about that. And we don't have another weapon for him, do we? No, okay, so we're good. I know, I should probably do all of this, um... Looking around the town off-screen. But I'm doing it just because I know that... I need to prove to you guys over and over again just to make sure that you guys do go and look, you know, for these treasures, because you never know when they're gonna, where they're gonna appear. Yes, I know, you're still running, uh, daytime and nighttime cycles, whatever. Oh, well, there's a person all the way over here, what are they doing? Hmm. Hello. Do you believe that story that Mary Byrne once killed the King of Beasts? I really doubt that, you know? <laughs> anyway, let's see. Um, there's a treasure over here. Fluffy donut for uh, Mike. Let's take that. Okay. 
Yeah, this is there. I just don't think there's any reason to pick it up and stop it doing anything. Oh, no, we don't want to do that. Yeah. Okay, now the treasure's out here. So, yeah. Now, I don't know, like I said, I don't know why I'm showing this off, because they're not, the treasures aren't going to sh uh, show up in the exact same place that I'm showing them, you know, because you might set up your map differently than the way I set it up, and I highly recommend you do that, because, I mean, you never know when, um, like, you never know how my rating's going to be, uh, as opposed to yours. I mean, you can throw them all over the place if you want. And see how the rating changes, you know, because people will be like, oh, you put this here? Oh, thank you, that's where I wanted it to be, or, um, yeah. Anyway, this is up to 26 minutes. Um, I'm actually thinking about, like I said, following through with my other plan of, uh, changing to another game. So, um, yeah, I'll be doing that after I grab these. Now, here's the most unedible sounding item in the game. Um, I don't know if we've had one of these yet, but it's called a grass cake. Yeah, it's pretty nasty sounding. Well, anyway, I'm going to save this here, and, um, uh, well, memory card slot, there we go. And, um, I'll meet you in the next game I play. Till then, everyone.